Hey folks, this is just a quick video PSA regarding what chemicals you use to clean your fruiting room if you have a commercial mushroom farm. Uh, this is the result of distilled fumes in the air around the mushroom while it's developing on a black pearl oyster mushroom. You get this insane rose comb outbreak on the caps, which is technically still safe to eat, but it's just a terrible looking uh, deformation. Uh, just caused by certain disinfectants that will come in contact through aeration on the caps of the mushroom. You can see different uh, manifestations of it. If we go into the grow room now to see what's growing, you can see this same thing playing out. This is a very interesting looking rose comb where you can really see these defined gills. It almost looks like a morel uh, gill. Um, so these are caused by either oil in the substrate or distillate fumes in the atmosphere while the mushroom is growing. So I don't see a lot of documentation out there about this whenever I was trying to research it, but it's, that's what it's caused by. Another thing that you can see is uh, bacteria or water dripping on the cap of the black pearl oyster mushroom will cause these. And when you cut the mushroom open, you get a cross section. These black dots are lines that go all the way down through the stem. So that's caused, I have this lines made up here that will drip water on this cap, but I kind of let it happen to see as an experiment. Uh, and this one as well is just exposed to a lot of water on the cap of the mushroom and bacteria. You can see all these black dots. So these are things to look out for while you're growing these kinds of mushrooms, this black pearl oyster. You can see this one actually just completely aborted, has this puffed out uh, gill while the cap is very small. And this one as well, you can see a mutation there. So those are some of the mutations that I've noticed with these uh, black pearl oysters.